now how simple is that now with this option you don't have to you have absolutely nothing to uh, you have absolutely no nothing to worry about uh, absolutely no reason to worry about the chapter numbering if you want to mismatch if you just want to move the chapters within the documents around uh, push it one to the last one other to the num other to the front move it one move it one between like that so on and so forth if you want to do all that instead of numbering them manually uh, LaTeX takes care of the numbering so nicely for you you don't have to worry about it just move the document as per your move the pages as per your choice and everything takes care of okay now you might ask me okay this is so far so good but I am finding it this a little bit difficult see if I were to write a chapter and if uh, my this chapter which I which I'm showing here is very simple but in the actual cases you might uh, be in a position wherein you have to include a very 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 big chapters and stuff and uh, if you were to handle this in an entirely in a single tech file it may be just too big to handle so how do I go about with that condition well it's simple what uh, report what report class allows is that it gives you freedom to include files external to include files meaning you write your you write your chapters in separate tech files and just include them wherever you want in the document don't believe me watch watch how it, watch how it works now what I'm doing is that uh, let me open this folder okay for now let me delete this log uh, uh, the tech files okay let it be there talk on tech file let it be there this PDF file okay let me delete all that so what I'm doing is okay let me uh, I just have three tech files over here this is report and that's what we're operating on your tech maker I have a normal I have a file called as normal.tech and a file called as protarian.tech okay now let me open this with the genie okay just in another editor if I, for those guys who haven't know, know, know what genie is just in another editor no, don't worry now if you see this is uh, actually another tech file having section, subsection, sub subsections, and so on with its own chapter name. The chapter name is Normal People. Now, I have written an entire chapter in this tech file. Okay, now my question is how do I include this in the file? Simple. Since you have written this nicely with the chapter title and everything, what you can do is that go to your tech file. And just and tech file and the tech make and LaTeX has an extremely easy command to include your files and that file is called a, that command is called as backslash include and that's it. Now what you do is that just put the backslash include command and inside the inside the curly braces you just write the file name without the extension. By default it's understood that it takes a text tech file as the input so you just write uh, the tech file name without the extension. And this file name we are looking at is actually normal.tech. If you can see at the top, it's normal.tech. So you just don't have to worry about the tech extension. Just write it, um, okay? Just write it over here, and that's about it. By the way, that by the way, this is actually my IPython notes. I'm just as when I'm doing working with all the stuff, I'm just uh, documenting down so that uh, it can be useful for me for my future reference. That's about it. Okay, if you guys don't know what IPython notebook is, just go and check my uh, scientific Python, scientific programming using Python tutorial that will be useful for you guys. Anyway, coming back, coming back, I uh, just you just have to include, you just have to use this line include normal and that's it. The chapter normal will be included. Now to run this, just build this file twice and there you have it. And then the chapter for normal people like uh, like. If you look at if you look at this chapter and this chapter over here, which is which I've written over here, they are just exactly the same. Pretty neat, huh? Now this way you have an option to write include your documents nicely. Okay. Now the now one more thing. One more thing. There's actually a subtle difference uh, between include and input file. Sometimes what happen what happens is that okay. Uh, you can write your chapter name like this with the command chapter backslash chapter and then you can have a you can put the put the file as an input like this now this again works now if you want this to happen there are two conditions 
first in your uh, the file which we looked at which is namely fruitarian okay if you look at the fruitarian file well let me open this genie let me open this genie and also let me compare this with the normal file which we had last time if you see this normal.tech file had this line called as chapter normal people normal people okay so as it when since this chapter line is included in the file itself yeah, when you include that you can include the file in the document you don't have to put chapter uh, normal people for explicitly it's in it's in it's understood when you put the include include file name it's just it's it's understood so not a problem on the other hand on the other hand if you were to just write section if you just were to write mere contents like these okay and without any uh, we just sections subsections and stuff without any chapter name and stuff okay then it becomes mandatory to for you to put chapter name like this just write chapter uh, chapter name and then afterwards afterwards you just copy the file and stuff so there's a two there's, so you have to keep in mind two things if your external chapter file does not have this backslash chapter chapter name on the top top write the chapter name for a chapter command and chapter name in your main tech main report tech file and then use input command to include the file if your file has chapter title included like this then just use include backslash include command file name to include it and you don't have to worry about it so when you do this okay when you do this if i were to build this twice your chapters get included nicely and if you go to the table of contents the table of contents also turns out to be fine now the thing is what if i just comment this out now this input file does not have a chapter title in it so if I, what if i just comment this out and i build it what happens is th what happens is that what happens is that uh, this chapter fruitarian loses its chapter identity and it just it just gets thrown into the other other page and uh, it loses its identity and uh, and one more thing the sections part they just continue from where the previous chapter left so this previous chapter normal people left at 4.3 so the beginning of this so called chapter begins with 4.4 instead of 5.1 so it just loses its chapter identity so that's one thing you have to keep in mind input file input file is used for including uh, fragments of the document fragments of the document which does not have any specific format on their own other than chapters and sub chapters and stuff whereas include is is as explicitly for uh, including fi tech files which have their own predefined formats like appendix or chapters so that's a very very key thing you have to keep in mind and that's actually the subtle difference su very very subtle difference of using include and input chapters uh, input input and include commands okay that's about that's about this that's about it and this way what you have is that you just have an entirely an entire full fledged uh, report made ready using latex now one the thing is if you ask me whether this report is full fledged i will say no of course not because uh, because this this report has a nice uh, front page it's okay not bad okay but other than that this report page does not have uh, this report page does not have uh, so your contents it has your contents con table of contents but does not have any figures or tables okay and it chapters are fine it does not have any reference at the back so can you give me one document which has all of these figures chapters uh, fig, uh, list of list of pages list of con tables and everything simple it's a thesis one example is a thesis and even your report can have it so what i'm going to do is that in the next tutorial the next tutorial um i'll be con uh, i'll be telling you guys, i'll be giving you guys a brief explanation as to how not a brief explanation a nice walk through of how to create your own uh, report template with a sample example okay i ha i have a template of my own i mean 
not exactly of my own i just refer to several pages several blogs on the internet where several people have written a lot of ideas for the, for making documents and thesis documents thesis and reports i just kind of used some used several ideas which i had which i had got from several uh, blogs and just made a, a report of my own thesis report of my own i can te- i'll teach you that in the in the subsequent tutorials and from which you will just have a good idea of how of as to how to create your own thesis or a report format on your own and in the next coming tutorials we'll be uh, we'll be seeing as to how to make your own thesis and uh, which is also applicable for your report as per report style report on your own okay that's all i have for you guys in this tutorial thank you guys for watching and i'll see you guys next time so take care bye